Although I don't know when you're going to actually be watching this. But I thought I would vlog today because I've got some packing to do for Glow Up. I've had a few parcels arrive. I've had my gusto arrive so I can tell you what we're eating this week. Um, I'm hopefully going to try and film that this week because it's been a while since I've done that. Um, what else have I got to do? Just a real bit of a catch up because I haven't. So this will be this week's vlog. And yes, yeah, so I just thought I would catch up with you so first of all i thought i would show you a little bit of behind the scenes of glow up so it's monday morning i'm just about to parcel up some of the orders that i've had over the weekend we launched the glow mist which is a self tanning water so i've got a few of those to send out um glow up is going really well a few people have said like what has happened with it why haven't you spoke about it and if i'm honest it's because i just feel really I don't ever want to like push things in people's faces and it's my own business and I feel like I don't want to be like glow up glow up glow up um but it is a big part of my life so there will be little snippets of it which I hope you don't mind but it is going really well we did we started so so well and then we had a bit of a dip and I think it was because I think it was the second lockdown that we started to have a dip and if I'm honest I can completely understand that you know people weren't people were struggling so they weren't focusing on like buying things for themselves that are really of a luxury and also Lucas is in the downstairs toilet probably making a mess by the way um and also um people weren't going anywhere so you know tan not going anywhere but now the weather has picked up we've had a few more orders and i'm really trying to push it i did go through a bit of a lull with it because i was really like stressing have i done the right thing but i am full guns guns blazing with it now so i'm going to show you um a bit of packing now also while i remember i've taken my extensions out um i really didn't get on with them in this heat um i have worn extensions for years but i tell you what i just couldn't deal with them in this heat like my head was just on fire i've taken them out and my hair feels in really good condition so i'm gonna just keep them out for a while and see how i get on i was ditching the bleach but um you know we'll see how i go with that because i like this really blonde down here um but i'm just gonna bide my time and carry on keep going so yeah i'm gonna pack those orders now and i will speak to you in a bit i'm going cleaning today at my father-in-law's um yeah i'll speak to you in a bit guys okay so you might find it a bit weird that i am packing and filming this on a radiator cover but i promise there is a method behind my madness and i don't normally pack here don't worry it's just that the sunlight was coming through the front windows and it was a really nice place to do some filming if you do have a small business i can highly recommend filming some pack with me's which is what i'm actually doing in this video here and it's amazing how popular they are on tiktok and i really am trying to build up glow ups presence over there as well so yeah if you do have a small business i suggest doing some pack with me's they are so addictive to watch as well this is actually i'm i think i'm packing up katie's order here actually so katie if you are watching this is your order thank you so much for purchasing from us i really appreciate it so yeah i'm just going to film and do a couple of these parcels and then get on with my day so i've just been into home bargains i thought i would show you quickly what we bought i've got the two boys in the back honestly today was such a rush the last time i saw you i was there packing up orders you know filming some feet some content for tiktok and then the doctors rang me and was like lucas's mmr booster just to remind you lucas's um mmr booster is at 11 <laughs> This is at 22 11. Both kids are still in the pajamas. I'm prattling about doing product shots. So I've literally just come out in my pajamas. Um, well, they're technically loungewear. So, you know, who cares? Best top and shorts. It's a nice time, to, nice um, 
weather state anyway everybody's looking at me this is really uncomfortable for me but you know we're all about pushing outside of our comfort zone so i thought we'd show you quickly what i got from home bargains the boys got these swords that they're weighing and poking myself in the head with and lucas has just whacked a random woman with one so you know winning life today i just bought a couple of cleaning stuff my friend who is a cleaner swears by this ace ace for whites um and i cannot get matt's um gym he has gym towels for his clients the white ones and i need to get them back white white so i bought that i also oh, i'm gonna put that back in the bag just in case i also bought some normal bleach for cleaning um this thick bleach is only 39p which is so good i don't know how much it is in Aldi normally um i picked matt up some radox shower gel he wanted some baby oil but they didn't have any baby oil in store I also picked up some Dr. Beckman washing machine cleaner because I cleaned my washing machine yesterday and used the last lot I had. Um, I then picked up some toothpaste for the boys and then I picked up these. These were $4.99. These are hair lush locks gummies. Now I don't normally buy into things like these because I know that it's better to just buy like glucosamine or um cod liver oil and stuff are really good but i ha i hate taking tablets and these gummies i found that when i did have these i did take them a lot more so i picked these up for 4.99 there is 60 in there i'll tell you what they taste oh my god i can get in them they're like superman sweets okay oh they smell lovely they taste good mmm can I taste one? You can have a Superman sweet and get home. These are really nice. So but yeah. Really Wait. Nice is it one or two a day? Hold on. It's do not exceed recommended dose. Oh, two a day. So this is a month in here then, so I can have another one. Mmm, yeah. They taste really, really nice. So pick those up. And also some frisbees for the boys. These were only 59p each. Matt wanted to get them for the boys. Mom, can we have those for the beach? We can have them at home, darling. So yeah, I'm off home now to finish my packing and actually have some breakfast and a cup of coffee. And I will catch up with you in a minute, guys. Change of scenery. I've just got to my father-in-law's. It is my cleaning day today here, but I'm going to attempt redoing this floor. So if you did watch a video, I did a home bargains haul last week and I purchased these vinyl stick-on tiles and I said that I was going to do this floor with them and today is the day, guys. I thought I would bring you with me and show you how I get on. So first things first, I'm going to show you what it looks like before and then I'm going to take up all the old floor and start tiling i cannot wait to transform this space it's just been an area that's been a bit neglected and is just in dire need of being done so yeah let's get straight into it you're a rebel getting into trouble you are kind of like a fire like a fire like a fire unpredictable so original you will never back in have like this 
carpet on here just to try and make it look a bit better but what I thought since I have some tiles left is I'm going to cut a couple and put them on the top here I just thought that would make it look quite cool so I'm going to use a tile to do across the top and then I might even put one on the front of it I'm going to see what it looks like but I thought that might look quite cool Okay, so here it is gonna be, guys. I'm just gonna give a recap of what it looked like before. It did take me two occasions of coming back and finishing it, but here we go, drum roll, please. This is it now. Oh my gosh, it has made such a massive difference. There is still a lot that I need to do in here. I need to really repaint it all and give everything a really nice freshen up, but just to start with the floor, I can't believe how much difference it's made. Yeah, I'm so happy with it. still a couple of things I need to do at Matt's dad's in that little room but I thought I would show you me doing that floor because I know this is really dark isn't it hold on let me see if I can put my ring light on that's better hi guys so I'm back from cleaning Matt's dad's um, I thought I would show you laying that floor because I know that a few of you watched the Home Bargains haul and saw the tiles and really liked them. So I thought I would show you what they look like. I can't believe how much of a difference I've made. It's like incredible. Anyway, while I am here, I thought I would show you. I bought something off eBay which I have to share with you. I'm going to, I don't know whether I'm going to put it on my bed today. If I do, I will film it. But I bought these bed sheets. They are Sea Sucker. I don't know if you can see them. There was a few options. I bought two of this one. Let's see if I can get it close. Um, I love having a love. <laughs> I love having white bedding in, but it's just like awful to keep clean. But hopefully, using the Ace bleach that I got from Home Bargains, that will really help. But um, this was on eBay, and it was the biggest bargain. So the more you buy, the cheaper it is. I bought two of these with postage, £29.22 for both sets. So that's £15 for a double. Now I usually get king size because my, my blanket's king size, but I don't know, I got double this time because I need to get a new duvet. It's just not right anyway. <laughs> that's another story. I got two of these anyway, so I will show you. 29 pounds 22 pence and they came in a lovely like pink bag but i can't i've thrown that away now it's the online home shop so yeah i thought we'd show you that but they did loads of different ones um and they did it in white gray and pink but i picked up two of those for myself and then finally before i leave you today because i don't want to have a hefty long vlog again for you all i don't want to bore you um, Gusto has arrived, so I'm just going to unbox it because it is a good week this week, I think. <laughs> now, Gusto, um, I paid for this myself, by the way, just so you know. Um, it's not gifted or, uh, blah, 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 or sponsored or anything. I just really like it, and I think it's definitely worth trying once. I think at the moment with my code, you get your first box for £14. And then if you recommend a friend, they get it for £14. And you get, I think I get, if one of you guys sign up, I get like £10 credit. So, yeah, I did get some credit because you guys signed up. But um, then once your credit runs out, you just pay for it. <laughs> That's how it works. Um, but yeah, I just thought I'd show you what's in this week's. And then I'm trying to think what else I've got to do today. I've got some more work to go to for glow up, I think, this afternoon. Okay, 
also this week we have black bean beef and pepper stir fry that is a lean 15 then we have chili chicken cashew noodles which i really love i've had that one before salt and pepper chicken breast with egg fried rice i love 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 <laughs> that normally um, and then we've had this one before this is an all chopped and these are great if you need to cook something really quickly because they literally take 10 minutes when they're from the all chopped recipe that means that everything's already chopped <laughs> as it says on the tin but this one is the sweet and sour chicken with I don't even know how you say, is it edamame, 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 edamame rice, that rice anyway, let me see those children, how I'm going to deal with these children for another like six weeks is beyond me, any advice, <laughs> welcome, um, so yeah I'm just about to pull the gusto away now and then I think I might try and pop, I really want to go to Home Sense and Primark, if I do, I might take you with me, but I all, I've got the anxiety of filming outside at the moment. Um, and I really have still got to film my Primark um, haul with you because a few people have asked like, where things are from. And it's like, oh, it's from Primark, it's from that haul that I just still haven't done because I'm, I'm crap. But anyway, I hope you all have a fabulous day. I'm going to go now um, and I will speak to you in, next, in the next vlog. Bye, guys. Got reach. <laughs> See ya. Forever. I watch you as you drive. Do you know I'm looking?